I guess it's time. Thanks for stopping by on my channel, as always. Appreciate it. It's another edition of Funko Tuesdays. Happy to keep the tradition keeping uh, going, you know. I try, I try. Um, I got a real cool video for you guys today. Uh, got a few good pops that I've been enjoying. Uh, loving the design and the characters. Uh, two great shows that I watch. Um, one finished, but there's more to come. And the other one is about to come back soon. This month, really. So can't wait for both of those. And um, got them at my local GameStop, as always, you know. They always look out for me over there. Cool guys at my local GameStop. Always appreciate them. Um, so let's get into what I've gotten. I want to show you guys. Now, if you've seen my previous Funko Tuesdays, I was able to get a, a few of the Game of Thrones stuff. The new line, the Game of Thrones pops. And I was able to, uh, I told myself I was going to go back and to get new, when the new ones came out. And try to finish the line. So I was able to get a couple new, a couple more to add to the line, and eventually try to finish the line. And the first one I got was um, this Jon Snow right here. So this is a very dope pop right here, Jon Snow. This is what all of these are from like the last season, pretty much. I'm, I'm, I think this is the line, as I said from like my last video. So I was able to get the Jon Snow. This is a very cool right here. Same with his sword. Pretty much, yeah, when he was, like, I guess, fighting the, about to fight the Night King in the final season. This is, like, him, I think this is probably that uh, War, episode 3, uh, Battle at Winterfell. So, actually, I actually like that episode. Um, the ending uh, was kind of, like, eh, a little bit, I was, it was a whole bunch of stuff, but for the most part, 90% of the episode I really loved. And the, the last 10% I was kind of like scratching my head a little bit. And there's a lot of questions about it. But but this is the pop right here. This is Jon Snow holding his sword. You know, his unique outfit that he wears. Uh, very cool. The guy's little man bun in the back. <laughs> and stuff. So, very cool right here. Jon Snow. The detail is awesome. Look at his sword. He has his little, he has his, if you can see, he has his little kind of like scarring and stuff on him. Been through a lot of battles and stuff. So. Very cool right here, Jon Snow. And the next one I was able to get is the Night King himself. And this was cool because um, he got um, stabbed with a dagger, as you can see here. And he turned all crystallized and broke up and pretty much turned like this and then, and then died. And although um, I don't want to spoil it for anybody, I pretty much did kind of spoil a little bit, but <laughs> I won't spoil anymore. But yeah, this is the continual line. So now I have, I have Jon Snow, I have Night King, um, I have Theon, and so I still need the Six Inch Mountain, Sansa, Arya, and King Bran, the Broken. So um, this is definitely a cool pop. Um, when I saw it coming out, I'm like I definitely want to get that one with the when he got stabbed. I'll show you guys how he looks like. This is pretty cool. It's definitely kind of a different model than like usual pops. A lot, of, a lot, very solid. It's like a solid, like crystal form. And this is like the dagger right here, if you can see. He got stabbed with, and um, turned into all crystal. So this is cool. He has his little ice sword in the back. And he's the Night King himself. And um, the character who plays him is actually coming to my Comic Con also. So I have a few Game of Thrones guys coming to my Comic Con. So it'll be very cool to see those guys. So very awesome. Yeah, awesome indeed. The Night King himself. So yeah, we're very happy with this pop. Uh, very cool. So next, um, that was all for my Game of Thrones guys for now. And um, next sh uh, next show that I collected um, is an anime that I really like. Um, me and my good friend Rob Molina, we we watch it. Um, he's he was he got a lot further than me. I had to catch up, but um, I finally caught up, and now I'm like reading a little bit of the manga, getting a little gist of what season I think it's what four gonna be about. 
but I can't wait for the new season to come. I think it's um, very soon. I think it's October 12th or something like that. And um, we will be getting uh, a sub and dub like simultaneously. I, I, I just I guess got news of. So I guess they'll be going at the same, like almost at the same pace. Um, I usually, I don't mind doing the dub, but I like the sub also. Um, I like All Might's, um, I think it's Chris Sabat. He does the All Might's um, voice. He's Vegeta in uh, Dragon Ball, he's, um, in Dragon Ball. And um, so I like I like um, I like him as a voice actor, and um, so I can listen to him in English, or I can just I can listen to sub the Japanese voice actors, which is also awesome. But uh, my first one that I got from the new wave of my hero, well not the first one. Let me see, is that the first one? Yeah, this is the first one <laughs> of my new the new wave. Is this guy right here, and this guy is Funky Age, Funky Cage, <laughs> Tokoyami. Um, my good friend Rob can pronounce these names a lot better than I can. <laughs> um, I always mess him up, and he's always making fun of me for doing that. But this is a very cool character. Um, in My Hero Academia, they have quirks. The quirks work as uh, powers, pretty much. They're pretty much like superheroes and um, superheroes in training. Um, these guys are students, and they all have different forms and uh, different. They, they can look human form. They have to look like creatures, etc. But this is a very cool. He has like a power. It's called like Dark Shadow. And his quirk pretty much like the shadow, he's a lot stronger at night than in the morning. And his dark shadow sometimes kind of takes over him if he's like, kind of, if he gets too strong, it's hard for him to control. But when you can control it, dark shadow does a lot of amazing things for him. And it's very, it could be defensive, offensive. So very cool. This is the line of the new line <laughs> of my hero. It got um, Izuku Midoriya, All Might as a teacher, Momo. Uh, see these names, I'm, I'm hard to pronounce them. This is a Euro, let me see, Eijiro, yeah, Eijiro, <laughs> uh, this guy I have right here, Silver Age All Might, and uh, All For One, so I got a few of these, I'm going to try to see if I can collect the whole line of this also, um, I'll show you how this guy looks like, I might not even say the names, because <laughs> I'm so horrible at them. This is a very cool, oh, almost dropped. <laughs> this is a very cool pop right here. Very cool design. You gotta see this dark shadow going across his back, coming out of him. And he has this little kind of like cape cloak thing that goes around him, like what he wears, that keeps keeps dark shadow hidden. And this is his design right here. Very cool. Uh, I love this character in the show. He's a kind of like, uh, he's kind of, He's not always out there, but he's like part of the main crew, group of kids, and he's very strong, and I love his personality, and I um, can't wait to see him more in like season four. It's very cool, and um, I'm not gonna pronounce his name again because I keep messing up, but it's awesome. Next, I got this is Ijiro Kurisama. <laughs> Sorry, this is him right here. Very cool, very cool. And his quirk is like Harden. Um, makes himself into like a, like all rock. So it could be a offensive move when he's like all rock and pretty much be very strong or defensive, protect himself. So it's very cool. Um, he's, he's very good friends with Batago. And um, Batago is another My Hero character. He's not in this line, but um, he's in the previous lines, I believe. I don't have every single My Hero pop. I should have collected all of them. <laughs> a lot of them are like becoming. A couple of them are becoming are, are grails now, and I'm just like, but um, it's okay. The very aspect of like these guys as students learning to be heroes, and it's cool because they're uh, licensed heroes. There are heroes who like kind of be like who are kind of like vigilantes in the show. And um, they don't really show them too much, but it's like a manga about it. The vigilantes that this bunch of kind of like people, kids with powers, quirks that didn't go to the school, and they're kind of like vigilantes. But uh, my hero focuses on more of like the kids who are in school and trying to get their hero licenses and become official heroes and like and pretty much grow up and protect society, you know. And um, they, they kind of do. It's cool because they can kind of do all kind of different things. There's different levels of heroes in that show. Um, some are like um, medics, some are like more of like um, cops in a way, and some of them are more like protectors, etc. 
there's different um, classes that are, some of them are really strong, some of them are okay, but it depends on the quirk they have that they are born with. And this is going back to this guy I took out. This is a very cool design. Um, you guys can see like the design right here. Very cool outfit. And he does like this little Harden, comes all rock. And he's a very strong character. He's a funny character also. So this guy right here. I'm not gonna say his name again. <laughs> but very cool. I'm loving this um this line and the designs are very awesome. Alright. Here. Like this for now. And the last one I got is All Might in a teacher form. And um All Might um was pretty much like the the main superhero of the, the show at one point um, in the beginning uh, he was like pretty much the, the one go to like when all the heroes kind of like with if the bad guy was too strong all might would come and be like don't worry I'm here and he was just kind of cocky with it but he's my favorite character in the show um, because of his um, he's kind of like a superman of the show um, this is he's he became a teacher and he's helping the students out especially Midoriya from like his disciple whatever and like learning and um this is a, a cool pop it's just as simple as him with his thumb up his thumbs up and he's in his teacher form and um this is definitely the silver age all my i love to get that one and um especially though i think there's a metallic version of him so that's cool uh pops trying to take him out you know, some of them give me a little trouble him right here very cool in his yellow suit nothing too fancy but uh, this is all might favorite character right here in the show um a lot of other characters have grown up uh growing on me and as i read more like into manga and as the new season comes along i know i'll, I'll definitely get more involved in like their relationships together and their um missions you know to to finally be like official Heroes getting through everything and uh, the bad guys have to, to fight and all that all together But it's definitely an awesome show. I found it uh, a long time ago and they only had a couple of episodes and I, I put it on the back burner for a little bit and then uh, my good friend Amelina just started watching it and binging it and he loved it so much I had to get back on it um, And I finally caught up and now I'm waiting to uh, the new season and we both can like watch it together and talk about it um, definitely um, in the comments, you know, if you guys like my hero, if you guys plan on getting this line or anything like that, um, I know NYCC is pretty much this week, <laughs> so I know you guys have been saving money for those, and um, myself included, and I'll definitely try to go some pop hunting to get those shared, um, those shared stickers, and and um, yeah, go from there. Definitely some cool pops coming out, and cool pops who are, what out are out now. So um, as always, thank you guys for tuning in um i have some other cool stuff coming out your way um some more story stuff and everything pretty much so um good time to be doing this stuff so i'm, ha I'm having fun with it kind of enjoy it thank you guys for always watching appreciate it it's mike funny it's mike popping stories you guys have a good morning afternoon and night peace